In the fall of 2007, Pacific Science Center celebrated its 45th birthday, and we're quite proud of what we've accomplished since 1962. Through the Science Education Outreach Program, the Science Center delivers programs to every county in the state of Washington. Our Environmental Education Center at Mercer Slough in Bellevue serves 8,000 students a year. Working with the Superintendent for Public Instruction, the Governor, the Legislature, and of course with your help, we're making a significant impact on science education. pull up in the morning and there are usually kids there helping us unload and they just see us and they say, the science people are here, the science people are here. Head out on the highway, looking for adventure, and whatever comes our way. I think it's important for children to see that science can truly be engaging and it can be fun and we bring in all kinds of hands-on materials that they wouldn't normally have access to. Yeah, We kind of have a little running joke that we feel like rock stars when we go into their school because they're extremely excited and they're extremely helpful when we're there and they just seem really genuinely interested in learning. It's a beautiful day today, and we kind of miss every now and then the connection between a swamp like this and this beautiful day. And what is the connection between that and the water we're drinking and all the other things that are going on? Teaching is the key. Jim Ellis helped lead the cleanup of Lake Washington and the creation of the Mountain to Sound Greenway. Now he shares his passion for environmental education at the Mercer Slough with Jerry Henry. The goal of the Environmental Education Center is to teach kids what the environment means to our overall health as, as, a, as people and as a community. Well, the Pacific Science Center, in being an active leader in a project like this, is playing a key role because it is bringing science to ordinarily observable facts that children can understand and relate to and teaching them the scientific method at the same time. Obviously with 8,000 students going through there a year, it was tremendously well used. With the ability to expand that a bit, and we can bring more students in, we can go from 8,000 to maybe 30,000. Uh, we can also involve the community more. What makes this center unique from all the other centers is this partnership that's developed between uh, the Pacific Science Center, the City of Bellevue, and the businesses to make this thing happen. A tremendously important a part of the success of, of the program. At the 37 summer science camps, young people are taught about the world around them. Oh, I see one! You see one where? You see one? Sydney, what do you think it is? You're right, that's an otter. The core mission of the Science Center is to inspire a lifelong interest in math, science, and technology. Environmental education is really important because the kids need to realize that they have a responsibility to the earth. Jessica attended science camp as a fourth grader, returned as a naturalist in training in ninth grade, and has worked every summer as a staff counselor. Now it's off to college to study science. I think I've learned a lot definitely from the experiences I had with the Science Center and the Mercer Slough Education Center. So that's a sea anemone. The Discovery Corps program provides high school students with professional training, allowing them to share their knowledge of science with visitors to the center, first as volunteers and then as part-time staff. People should be proud of Discovery Corps because you're giving teenagers a chance to go out and do something productive after school. 
it makes me so happy that people are learning from me. It shows that I actually learned something and I'm giving something back to the community.